It's Monday, July 29th. I'm Alex Mahadavan, here to report the daily headlines. An East County gas station was robbed at gunpoint early this morning. Witnesses report that two black males robbed the 7-Eleven gas station at 4227 State Road 64 at roughly 1.20 a.m. Manatee deputies searched for a man who robbed an elderly woman Sunday afternoon. Deputies say a skinny white male snatched an 86-year-old woman's purse in front of Marshalls on Cooper Creek Boulevard. A Sarasota firm makes a major land purchase. 4900 Clark LLC bought 29 acres of vacant land on Clark Road for $5.5 million. That's $2 million greater than it last sold for. Development continues on Longboat Key. The old Holiday Beach Resort will be demolished August 1st in preparation for construction of the planned 11-unit Infinity Condominium. Hotel Indigo hosts a Girls Inc. event. The organization put on its second annual Girls' Night Out slumber party, which included spa stations and a fashion show at the North Trail Hotel Friday. Volunteers open a Longboat Key Sea Turtle Nest. The Longboat Key Turtle Watch discovered a baby turtle during a nest opening Friday, which brought out more than 400 spectators. Two Sarasota County deputies take home a national prize for savvy tech use. Sarasota County Sheriff's Office pilots Dave Buffard and Brent Winneka won third place at the FLIR Vision Awards presented at the 2013 Airborne Law Enforcement Association Annual Conference in Orlando. Speaking of awards, the Longboat Key Club and Resort receives a diamond distinction. The resort received its 30th annual Four Diamond Award from AAA. Underprivileged kids receive a back-to-school booster at Booker High this weekend. Hope Community Kids on Saturday put on its fifth annual Day of Hope, aimed at providing medical services, haircuts, and school supplies to homeless and low-income children and families. An embattled Longboat Key organization makes staffing changes. Sarah Olivero has been named Avian Hospital Administrator at Save Our Seabirds after three years with the organization. The tragic story of Oscar Julius Grant's 2009 death gains depth in director Ryan Coogland's Fruitvale Station. Observer film critic Pam Nadon calls the film, which documents the last 24 hours of Grant's life, gripping on every level. A Sarasota Nonagerian's family gives her a birthday surprise. Penny Williams' family came from as far as California to celebrate her 90th birthday Sunday on Longboat Key. For more information on these stories and more, go online to yourobserver.com, like us on Facebook, and follow The Observer on Twitter. And pick up a copy of The Longboat in East County Observer Wednesday and The Sarasota Observer and Pelican Press Thursday. And for fresh local content and videos, go to the Observer YouTube page and press subscribe. You, your neighbors, your neighborhood.